The importance of intelligence gathering in today's warfare cannot be overemphasized. Hence, the need for the Defense Intelligence Agency to provide intelligence support for the conduct of military operations. Presently, the nation is facing security challenges which have resulted in higher demands on our resources and the need for up-to-date intelligence which would aid in the successful conduct of operations against the insurgency, banditry, kidnapping, and other criminal activities in the country. The Defense Agency must therefore continue to play a pivotal role in providing intelligence support uh, for the conduct of all military operations. Commissioning this massive and laudable project comprising several flat, duplexes, shopping plaza, mocks, a church, and medical center, among several other social amenities. The Minister of Defense, retired Major General Bashir Salehu Magashi, expressed optimism that personnel output at work will be greatly enhanced. I was glad that the leadership of this agency thought it wise to include a shopping complex, a worshiping center, and hospital to cater for the needs of personnel that will reside in this estate. There is therefore no doubt that output of work will be greatly encouraged and enhanced. With the current margin disturbing trends and the challenge of insecurity, the Chief of Defense Intelligence, Air Vice Marshal M. N. Usman, says the need to reposition the Defense Intelligence Agency to respond and improve on its overall delivery is paramount. We focus on five imperatives. A redefinition of our rules, objectives, and the structure necessary to perform. Capacity building and career development. Capabilities enhancement. Forging of national and international synergies and cooperation. And last but not the least, as mayor welfare. Some of the beneficiaries were presented keys to the apartments. High points of the event was the presentation of gifts and souvenirs to invited guests. The estate was named after the fifth chief of defense intelligence, the late Air Vice Marshal Idi Musa. Godwin Amundi, Liberty News.